Christmas theme. I'm so excited. So when you first come in, it's the entryway. Um, the only thing Christmassy ever we have is this here, but you come in, it's our entryway. We have a place for your shoes. Take your shoes off when you come in, thank you. And then this is just a place for our keys and the, our mail to go. It's the entryway, very simple. Excuse the washer, let me speak louder. When you come into our, um, to the left, we have our kitchen here. It's just, you know, your normal kitchen. We just have our stainless steel appliances, um, dishwasher that we don't use, refrigerator, I like this refrigerator. Our fridge is empty right now, gotta go grocery shopping, but yes. Stove, I like this, it's a electric stove. I like that, it's different, I grew up with a gas stove, so I like that. And yeah, we just kept it very simple in here, the normal appliances, I like here because we have this nice large size pantry which we don't put our food in so if you come over that's not where you will find our snacks. Um, I like this little station over here because this is where I have my little teas and my little cooking utensils. Let me chop up my little. Yeah, very cute and um, very simple. And um, you can check out my decorate with me to see all my Christmas decor, but um, a few things I did change, so I have this here. So then, straight across, we have my our loud laundry going off over here, but obviously, whoa, that's loud. I'm in the midst of doing laundry, that's our washer and dryer, and I like it because we have all of this storage space, and um, the washer and dryer unit is pretty large, so I like that. When you come straight through this little small hallway, you have the guest bathroom, which Maine considers it his bathroom, but it's actually the guest bathroom. I just went with brown neutral tone colors in here, so we just had the shower curtain that we actually took from our last bathroom. This little hello sign over here. I tried to keep this bathroom very masculine, but also, you know, my vibe as well. We had this picture over here. I actually got this picture from Family Dollar. Don't sleep on Family Dollar. And someone gifted a main, one of Maine's friends gifted us these nice towels with the N embroidered on there, stitched on there. Um, for Nicholson's. <laughs> gang, gang. Through this door is actually Maine's closet, but um, unfortunately, guys, he said his room is off limits for the door, so that's that. So then we'll come to the common area, my favorite part, one of my favorite parts of our home. I love this area. I'm always redecorating, so this is the current decoration that we think we're going to keep it this way for a while, but... We just have our the bar stool um, area here. Very simple. Got these chairs from um, Marshalls. So then we come to this whole section over here. Let me have a seat because it's cute. Oh wow! <laughs> this little decoration that I just moved over here. And um, this area, I don't really know what it's meant to be or really what I want it to be, but. I love this bench that we got from Marshall. These pillows I got from Target. So this section is really just like a sitting area. I can sit and read. I really just sit here and put my shoes on and call it a day. So here in the middle we have our dining room table. For the Christmas decor, I really wanted to keep the colors kind of the same to tie in with the rug and with the chairs. Also this tablecloth because um, I just didn't want to buy a new one, nor have I still ironed it for my previous video, but you know, hey, Christmas is three days away at this point. This cute rug that we got is from Burlington. Really like the rug. You might see Ava's toys on the floor, that's fine. At this point, she's like our kid, toys. And then, so now we can move into the living room area and our couch is a sectional and I separated it to come up with this little thing that we have here, but I really like it. 
It forces us to actually use our dining room table, but we can still watch TV. And I can also still see the TV when I'm cooking. So that's pretty cool. So over here on this side, I just had these two pillows. This one is actually from, oh, hold up. This is from Home Goods. I forgot, I got this. That's the one thing I got from Home Goods ever in my life. And this pillow is from Target. Throw is from Target. You can sit here, you can lay out and lounge. Or if you want to sit and be more comfy and professional, you have this side. Um, and then all of these pillows came from Target. These obviously came with the couch. And this mistletoe blanket, Mom, when you're seeing this, you can see now that I took your mistletoe blanket when I moved out the house. Okay. And then this little section here is just the date little books I just wanted to really tie in the red and um I also didn't really have anywhere to put them so <laughs> did that this whole centerpiece section is all from Target this basket I want to say might have came from Marshall but then again it could have came from Target I don't know either Target or Marshall and um then over here we just have our TV set up our little fireplace. <laughs> our little fake fireplace is cute. Let me get our Christmas tree. Thumbnail. That is that. Oh, and this actually on the floor, it's actually, I believe it's a blanket. And we just use it as a rug because when we got Ava, she really liked it. So now we just keep it on the floor. And these two ottomans came from Big Lots and wow I'm drawing a blank I can't remember where the other ottoman came from and then over here we have this basket full of blankets however Ava thinks this is her bed or let me show you where her bed actually is I put it over here in the corner where nobody can see and she can be out of the way for like when company comes over, i.e. my mom, and she's not all up under her. And she just will not sleep over there. I don't know what her issue is. And here's the queen of the house herself. Over here we have Maine's office slash game room slash, I don't know, but this is Maine's room, as you can see. Raven's Road, gang gang, we use Raven's hands in this house, but um, big trust. He said we cannot go in here, so it's off limits, sorry guys. <laughs> so then we'll move on to the last room in the house, which is actually the master bedroom. Here we go. And here is our master bedroom, kept it very simple with the colors black and white. Um, I'm going to turn this light off so y'all can see how dim it pretty much is in here. We like to just keep it very minimal and subtle in here. There's no TV. Over here, we just have little decor that I took from the living room once I changed for fall. So, um, oh, we actually have a sign here that um, what, um, one of Maine's friends, they gave us when we got engaged. They gave us this sign. It says, Faith, it doesn't make things easy. It makes them possible. Luke 1, um, 37. I really like that, but also the aesthetic of it. Not just the scripture, but the aesthetic of it. With the little flowers. That was pretty cute. Then over here, we have our Mr. and Mrs. section. A little sign of... When we say I do, how many days into our wedding, and this uh, musical ball actually plays music. And then we have a booklet that has 365 days of prayers for couples, and we're gonna start this once we actually like say I do. Excited for that, but this is our Mr. and Mrs. section that we were gifted at our engagement party. Over here, just some, some little incense and a card that Maine I kept it from, um, if you check out my birthday vlog, which I'll link up below, this was the sign on the bed that Joan had them write out. So cute. In our bed, our nightstands look kind of messy, but that's just how it is on the usual. Then this section, didn't really know what to do here, so we just had this stool that I'm holding onto for some sentimental reason. I can't give it up. Got the stool from Family Dollar, though, if you were wondering. The mirror 
came from Big Lots or Walmart. I think it came from Walmart. And then we just have our hamper. This section is kind of whatever. We can move on to the master bathroom, which is my bathroom since Germ considers that the bathroom his bathroom. But I kept it very subtle in here as well. White, a little bit of rose gold, a little bit of tan. Mainly white. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. This hot chocolate's getting me all pumped up, I guess. Bathtub, regular bathtub. I like it though, because it's like a soaking. It's a soaking tub. So, have I taken baths in it? No. But I like how wide it is. And then we have a closet over here where I just keep all of my little things and, you know, junk, toilet, and stuff. It's so much space in this bathroom, which I really like. Cabinets under the sink that we fill with stuff, bathroom stuff. And then over here I have all the bath towels, um, hand towels, washcloths, extra blankets, a little plant here just to kind of spice up toilet time. And then my absolute favorite, well, one of my favorite places, my closet, my walk-in closet. No, um, it's not really the nicest or aesthetically pleasing. However, I do really like this closet. It's close to my dream closet, not really but a little bit as far as how I can have my bags all up there and just have like clothes on this side clothes on this side shelves that aspect of it is like my dream closet but yes this is my closet sorry it's not like more aesthetically pleasing as I would like it to be but have shoes up there all my bags which I recently organized so that part I am aesthetically pleased with down in the morning and I like to just be reading my devotional when I'm lotioning up and getting dressed or whatever. Okay guys, that will conclude today's home tour. Um, Christmas themed. Uh, got the Christmas tree in the background. So obviously not every area in the house is decorated for Christmas, but the main areas are and I did change the layout of our place since um, my most, not my most recent, but one of my recent um, decorate with me video. I showed you guys how I decorated for Christmas. So um, yes, if you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up down below. Don't forget to share this video with your family and friends and subscribe to my channel if you're liking my content and don't forget to follow me on Instagram. And I'm really working on my Instagram, so head on over there and just, you know, give your girl a follow. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Happy holidays. Bye.